Hello, everybody, and welcome or welcome back to Brotato, the arena survival action roguelike itself. We are going to be checking out the Artificer again here with a dumb and hopeful idea. So the character has 175% explosion damage, 4% explosion size for every one elemental damage you have, which is really, it's very weird if you don't have a weapon without elemental scaling. It's strange. Uh, minus 100% damage, armor modifications reduced by 50%. So the plan is that I would like to go... We're going to be playing on danger level five here. I'd like to go for a rocket launcher build. That's the dream. That's the plan. So it's more likely on this character because we have the explosion weapon that we start with, the explosive weapon in the shredder. Uh, so there is a possibility there. Boink. Nope. Ah. Possibility there of finding it a bit earlier than you would think. Let's get a little bit of harvesting. It's an expensive potential weapon. So let's make sure. Should I ugly tooth? Yeah. Let's make sure we get a little bit of economy going early on uh, to try and make that work. Again, it's very hopeful. It's very dreamy to think that we will get the full suite. But I'll tell you what, if we find a rocket launcher uh, around like wave seven or eight, which I would say with an explosive tag weapon is it's not that weird. It's hopeful, but it's not that weird. Uh, we could maybe make a full pivot. Could maybe potentially make a full pivot. Let's get a little bit of luck there. Because, boy, we're going to need it. And let's just say, there we go. Bada bing, bada boom. Wave three, finding a blue weapon is, is kind of tough. So that's why I didn't want to do the reroll. Try and find that there. If we started with a lot of luck. Or we got, like, I don't know, 15, 20 luck by then. I'd maybe say saving up your money until wave three and just hyper rolling it open could be fine it's not like a good idea maybe i've seen blue weapons on that wave i just don't think it's uh that reliable range attack speed minus life steal that's okay attack speeds can just be really nice today luck is good sure uh, I'm probably not going to be taking that much elemental damage today, to be clear. Like, maybe if I went for nuclear launcher, if we got that going on, I might be a little bit more convinced to be going for some elemental damage. It already scales with it, or like plasma sledgehammer. Those I could, I could certainly be convinced to do it then. But without that, it's really tough to justify spending it on on the explosion size. It's a good stat, it's a nice stat, but I just feel like getting um, that epic item that does it for you is just good enough. Oh, I got so excited. This is wild. Uh, okay, we're, we're finding blues. We're finding blues, we're finding, uh, finding a freaking epic. We're finding things. That is for sure. But will we find a rocket launcher? That is the cue. Okay. You know, if we can't find it, this is a run that I'm excited to do anyways. I feel like I kind of want to get a redemption tour for this character who... The last time I played them was honestly god-awful. Like, I attribute it to the plank and maybe, you know, getting too much elemental damage when I really don't think you should. Could be some things like that. I'll take some range damage, take some percentage damage, and an, and an epic shredder. I need, a, like, a lot of coffees. Okay, we got our six weapons. The epic does... 31 damage. That is substantial. That is a substantial increase. Just a bunch of freaking rinky dink toy weapons and then an actual gun. Critting there for 62. Oop. Just wanted to pick up that health there. Giving me crates. Giving me a crate. 
No trees here, I don't think. Kind of tunnel visioning here, looking for a crate. Potentially. Nope. Engineering attack speed. I'll get a little bit more attack speed. Lumberjack shirt. Wave seven or eight. These are the waves where I'm like, all right. When I've gotten an exciting early... I mean, that's, that is nice. Oh, that is nice, but it's not what I'm looking for. When I've gotten an exciting early rocket launcher, I find them on like seven or eight. When I'm like, ooh, baby. So like, we are absolutely at the place right now where we would start to find that stuff. I am happy with the, the shredders I found though. Like, I, I cannot be mad at that. Like, we're, we got pretty lucky with finding um, non-common shredders early enough for them not to be too expensive. Good deal. This is shaping up to be pretty exciting. Pretty strong. I'm frail as hell. I have no armor to my name and stacking it up will be next to impossible. But I that's all I have to say. I'm, I'm frail. Range damage, armor, melee damage. I get some range damage. Got a lot of cool stuff, but not what I'm looking for. Got two coupons. I'm not gonna say no to. Another like epic shredder. I'm fine. I'm fine. I did so much cool stuff. This always happens on these runs where I have a plan and I'd like to find something else. I find like great stuff, and the game's like, appreciate me. You have full blue shredders on wave eight, you greedy little so-and-so. And I'm sitting here saying, yeah, you know what? You're right. This is this is a really nice start to a shredder run. It really is beating home how truly terrible and wretched the plank is, though. It, it just is nothing. Even on this character who is more or less designed for it, it's so bad. Okay. We are not good at the big boys. We do not do a good job with them. Yeah. Like, our damage isn't great. It's just very well spread. I don't want to reduce my harvesting right now. No to that. Have a little faith. So many coffees. What do we have? Four coffees. Four freaking coffees. This is a lot of attack speed. Absolute rapid fire. Shredders. This is wild, this run. I mean, it's going to look amazing on this wave. Like, this wave is the wave you want attack speed for. That's just the fact. You want attack speed here. Absolutely shredding. Absolutely shredding. You know what? I'm going to say it. I don't care about rocket launchers. I don't care about rocket launchers. We've got them, baby. They're not even that different. I basically have rocket launchers. I'd be sad if I got some right now. Wink. All right. This is a great wave. Great way for us today. More. Another. Nope. Huh. <laughs> well, I'll do that. I'll do that instead. I don't want to go. I don't want to get rid of too many, but I want to have less weapons, so I'm more likely to find the nuclear launcher. Scales with elemental. Scales with elemental. Now there is a reason to get elemental damage. Also, going to be a reason to turn off my um, explosions. Don't restart. Like we should theoretically be good already. 
God, I, I don't know. Part of me wants to ditch my my epic one, my epic shredder, to see if I can coerce the game even more. That goes from a one in four chance of my preferred weapon being a um, a, a shredder into wait wait one in four it being a nuclear launcher into it being one in three of being a nuclear launcher. That being said, I feel like I might need this to survive. Okay. You know what? I do not care about... I do not care about the rocket launcher. I actually mean it now. I was trying to uh, perform reverse psychology on the video game. But now it's true. Now I want nuclear launcher until I die, baby. I know. I know. I want a bomb. <laughs> what is this? I'm happy with it. I don't know which one I'm what I'm doing, but I'm doing all of them, I guess. Just when I now I'm like, you know what? I I just I wasn't going to be asking for nuclear launcher because it's rarer. It's harder to find. It's harder to get. But then, no. I just get that, too. And it's a heavy explosive, so I am more likely to find it. At this point, if I can just get all one or the other, I'm... I'm jazzed, right? Absolutely jazzed. Nuclear Launcher has the benefit of um, scaling off of elemental damage as well, though. Which I really like. Because it means that it's... It's viable to go for that explosion size. It's a bit more viable. And now I'm really happy with that. We have that 75% attack speed up, too. It's nuts. She got the elemental. Luck. Like, now we should... We're actually more likely to find a rocket launcher or a, uh, a shredder, is what I was going to say. We're actually more likely to find those... A, a, a rocket launcher or a nuclear launcher than a shredder. So, like, I'm going to probably... Oh, God. I'm going to probably die. Because so I have to actually try here. Please, I, w I just want enough healing to... Please, kill, 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 kill. Yes! Okay, good. <sighs> we have to try. We genuinely do have to try still for a bit. Like, as much as th this is amazing, exciting god tier, it's not a free win. I die in, like, a, a hit or two. I, I bet you there's some attacks in this game right now that do kill me in one shot. I have no armor. I need to have so much damage at this point that the final bosses die very quickly. I get a free legendary, which... <laughs> More attack speed. All right, I'm doing it. We won't find it anymore. All right. Ah. Still good. Still very good. Still so, so good. We have de-shreddered. I mean, I wouldn't mind a lot of dodge. 60% dodge. I would not mind that. And now I can say that I'm getting, uh, I'm getting damage by taking dodge. And it's not entirely wrong. I get a lot of attack speed. Love it. Love it. Like it, love it. Gotta have it. Okay. Still, the big HP guys are scary. You know, they could they could set their sights on me. They could dash at me when we're not firing at them. 
but this has obviously gotten pretty good pretty fast. Dodges attack speed. I don't know if I want to remove... Well, whatever. Oh, come on. Wave 14. It's probably too late at this point. I can't believe I didn't find any of the weapons now. Okay, this is a great one for us. Oh my god. This is this is the ideal one, I would say. Which is something I don't think I've said on any character for that one. But we we have really high AoE. And they don't have like a lot of uh, like the dashy boy is obviously very scary. Because we're pretty slow. Like, I should get some speed up. I have minus four speed, and I don't think I have really anything for utility. I don't think I took Snail to get that. I think it was like, um... I don't know. Why do I have that? I think I took Ugly Tooth, which is a bit of a lull at this point. Okay. No, but I do like it. Uh, fine. Uh, fine. Sure. <laughs> Stupid. There it is. Oh, it fires so much fast. Ter oh, interesting. We should be very likely to find rocket launchers now. I do like the nuclear launcher. Maybe I should have... Yeah, whatever. I can't be mad. I mean, like, look at this. All's well. All's well. That was a 900 crit from the nuclear launcher. Jiminy. What's doing? That's doing. That's doing the 450. Jeez, I don't know. I don't know, man. I am in danger in a di in a different way. So, like, obviously, I kill like crazy. I'm, I'm doing fantastic. I can't complain, but I have to make sure I'm paying attention because I am one shotable by a buffed creature for sure. And maybe just by, like, a spiky dashy boy. Like the thing that I used to call, I think, elites. But that wouldn't quite fit for now. Bad. A little late for that. I just don't want more speed down. I just don't want more speed down. Huh. Sad. All right. Oh baby. Boom 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 boom. This character at a base has the tools to become stupid. It's just it's just getting to the point where you find the stuff and then like being in a good enough place to sell it all so that this happens like my damage isn't great. My attack speed is off the wall, but uh, my damage stats, my damage is good, but my damage stats aren't great. This was mostly from base damage and my character's passive, you know? Like, not much has been from pickups. That being said, I am at 11 damage, even though I started at negative 100, so... I guess you could look at it like my damage stat is good, in hindsight. Being being in positive damage is being in good damage. Either way. Silly, silly, silly. God, why does it all have to have negative speed? I don't want your stinking negative speed. My 40 luck is uh, has been really, really nice, too. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. 
oh baby, oh baby. You know, we don't need to be full rocket launchers. Nuclear launchers are just fine to add in, I think. I, th I think that people might be okay with some of them being nukes. Correct me if I'm wrong. I could have all rocket launchers right now, but I guess I just was... Uh, I wasn't planning or even dreaming that I'd have the possibility to maybe go full nuke launcher. And I maybe, I probably could have. Probably could have. We, we scaled up very, 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 very well. I think that the, the biggest boon is, is truly how much attack speed we got before we turned into this monstrosity. Attack speed, base, flat damage. Oh my god. Oh my god. Sure. At this point, sure. Yep. Elite is the dashy boy. We need to kill him quick. I could get jumped by him. See? Full heal. Oh, I almost that what was that? One health? That I was I was worried about that guy. I was worried about that guy. I'm not really worried about anything else until the final boss. And in that situation, I think we'll be able to kill them quick enough that it won't be too much of an issue because we have, um, we have the, enough AOE and enough AOE size that we will probably be mostly targeting both of them for a lot of the shots of the nukes at the very least. I would assume, I'd assume. Fingers crossed we can take two hits from the boss. That's like... It's a lot. I guess I should get landmines, but... 41 damage. At this point, who cares? Snooze. Crit chance up. That'll actually be a lot for us at, at this point. 3% is nothing. Ch that chance to do double could be a difference maker on the boss fight. It's nothing until then, but we also... Guess what? Our damage upgrade is also nothing until then. This is basically like, how do we min-max killing the boss faster. That's really where we're at. How do we maximize our chance that the boss is going to die before I have to dodge an attack? That's the game that I'm playing right now, which is always a fun game to be playing. You know, like, that's how you know you basically... Like, I'm not talking won the game, like, roll credits, win game, but that's how you know you've actually won, truly. Internally. Win or lose the game, this was a victory of a run that I'm playing risky as hell. And it's paying off, you know, like the riskier you play, usually the less you have to dodge. Usually. Garbage. But you have to get there, you know? Nice. I have so much money. <laughs> Well, that's a pretty big get. Sad day. We we're one up. Okay. We should be able to super duper kill. Pretty early here. Yep. <laughs> yep, 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 yep. Stupid. 
So th this really, this is what this goes to show with this character. This character is not bad. This starting items, the items that you start with with this character are just pretty bad. That's really, I think that's the thing. So like the moment you can pivot, I would say the smart things I did today, two smart things I did today to increase my chances. A, oh, I guess three. I mean, I could say it's just one thing. It's the stats I prioritize. Luck harvesting attack speed helped me transition into this area really, really well. Being extremely risky with my pickups. Cy four Cyclops Worms, three Triangle of Powers meant like if we got hit, we lost 6% damage, but we just built our way into a spot where we could get hit or couldn't get hit. Anyways, uh, explosive shells is just a great item. I, last time I played this character, I didn't have it. Um, yeah, obviously dynamite, whatever. Like that stuff, no duh. But yeah, just going for it and then knowing how the shop system works, knowing to sell your weapons. The second I got my rocket launchers, it was early enough. I kept a couple so that I wouldn't die, but then selling them, um, selling them when you are safe to do so so that you can find more rocket launchers because this character loves loves weapons with high base damage and guess what rocket launcher and nuclear launcher have really high base damage uh retromation's hoodie is obviously a broken item just all in all everything came together to make this a truly truly godly experience that i'm not gonna say was easier than the yesterday's broken free win run um, because I had to try really hard in the beginning of this run, but, uh, yeah, I mean, like I had to dodge, I had to do certain dodges that would have been certain death, but it was pretty easy at the halfway point. I'd say about wave 10, 11 game, the game got easier as time went on, which was hilarious. But alas, alas, that is that. That's going to do it here for today. Thank you for watching. Check out the channel for roguelikes and more every single day. Be sad to see the series go. You gotta let me know in the form of a comment down below. Thank you for watching. Thank you. Thank you. I'll see you next time. Bye.